What's up everyone, my name is Nigark. Welcome back to Anno 2205. So from last time I let it sit a little bit, you can see that my credits probably doubled. Um, I just kind of walked away and let a cat brush sit on the plus key. Um, so yeah, I just wanted it to get some credits. I didn't want to hit a spot where, you know, I'm not able to expand stuff. Um, so there's some iridium, some iridium. I'm not super interested in those, but we did get another 11 graphene here. So stuff in this sector is looking pretty good until I do that, and then it's like, well, we kind of need some more vitamin drinks. Why aren't you making more vitamin drinks? So, let's work on vitamin drinks. Well, first, when you make vitamin drinks, you need some fruit. You need a lot of fruit. Now, the fruit takes up a big chunk of land, so this is probably going to be the rest of what I can fit in here. Consumer yeah, that's pretty much a low on vitamin life. drinks, which honestly I think can fit in here. It's a very low, or a very small building. Just kind of tack you in there. Okay, so now we are up on vitamin drinks, down on fruit, boo, down on fruit. So we'll fix up the fruit a little bit more. Actually, I think I can probably squeeze a little bit more out of this area. In fact, let's just get, I know what I'm going to do, okay. Limit reached on this, and then we're going to come on up. Let's get another vitamin drinks over here. It just, it's such a small building, I'm honestly not concerned about it. And plus we need it for the Arctic region as well. Yeah, so we are up. A lot. Like, a lot. Like, 74 up. That's pretty good. We are going to need to get our rejuvenators up a bit. And for rejuvenators, we need synth cells, which needs algae. How are we doing on algae? We're actually really good on algae, so let's do some synth cells. Um, let's do some synth cells. Not right there. Let's do them, like, right here. I'm just trying to squeeze out as much as I can out of this land without, you know, like, incredibly min-maxing it. So synth cells, very far up. Algae is still up, surprisingly. And we still need more water. Water is a bit of a pain in the neck, just because you can only get so much out of one because it's a coastal thing, and I have to be really careful about my coastal things. So let's see, where's a coastal thing? I'm sure I have one somewhere. Here's one. So let's bump this all the way down. Just straight down. Put on some production. Pretty good. And then we're gonna tack on some rejuvenators. Let's do it right here. I'm just trying to fill the gaps as well as I can. Without, you know, again, without, like, incredibly min-maxing it. So we are very high up on rejuvenators. Um, organic food we're a little bit short on. Just a little bit. Inside. And we need bioenhancers. So for this area, I think what I'm gonna just do is get a bit more organic food, expand my my force a little bit more, and then just sort of let it go. Let it go for a little bit. So organic food, do I have any of these just sitting around? Right, that is rice farm, okay. Again, trying to sort of remedy some of the things that I did, like this. And again, just Your an experience with the game. Something about fast solutions. Can I count on that? Oh, they want me to do a mission. Oh, right. Rice fields are enormous. So... 
Let's eat up all of this room back here. Um, this will probably get moved around even more in the future, but for right now I'm gonna let it stay. I don't intend to let that stay, I want it to look more something like this, a normal, a normal layout. And then, yeah, just expand my, my housing a bit over here. Like this. We're gonna have to do it like that so a road can get in there. I think a road can fit right there, let me make sure before... Yeah, okay, a road can get in there. And I'm also going to have a loop around over here somewhere. I just have to actually place these down before I do that. I don't think it will be able to go around that corner. No, it won't be able to go around that corner, and that's bad. Shut up. But what I can do is... Something like this. Just something like that. Fill in, fill in the little spots. Happy little buildings. Oh hey, another corporation level up. Nice. Just filling in the spots with these guys now. Wow, a surprising amount of these can fit in here. Look at all these things that I'm getting. Oh, you go right. Come on, move your mouth. Wow. <laughs> Those things are really easy to squeeze in there, aren't they? Um, that one won't work because I won't be able to get to a, ro a road to it. Yeah, so look at all these guys. It's a good day. You know, we'll even just upgrade all of them that I can. Sweet, I did it. Alright, next area. I know I just threw all my needs out of whack, totally fine with it. Totally fine with it. In fact, roots overview, new transfer route, we need to get these from here. Oh right, I can't. Not yet, not yet. Um, Which one do I want to work on? I'm going to work on this one. Let's work on the moon. I have a lot of credits. And you can see my the credit limit is... Every moon dweller. We should all work together. Check my count for assignments. It says account limit. I don't know what that means. It just it just says account limit. Normally there's a number there. <laughs> what, do I have my black credit card now? The one that it just says do whatever you want? Oh, okay. 2.2 million, so we're about halfway there. Workforce here is low. Imagine that. What are the chances? No shield protector. No traffic connection. I fixed it. But we still need workers. Credits maintenance? I have the credits. Don't don't you tell me I might I'm low on credits maintenance. I have credits. What do you think I'm broke? I ain't broke. No, we're gonna we're gonna fix this up a little bit. Gonna be like that. And then out here as much as eh, I'll tack it on right there for right now. Okay. Then more of you. There are only a few LEC colonies not controlled by the orbital watch. I can sell you the remaining stock from our warehouses and use the credits to buy supplies. I'd appreciate the business. I'll move you over one. And then do this. Oh, can I really not? Can I really not? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. 
I can't build on that one. Oh man, whatever, it's fine. So I need more workers. Oh. Well, it's because I need oxygen, I think. Maybe? I was like, prepared to live in a vacuum, but this place really has nothing to offer. Um well, I can make these so that they don't need workers at all, but the big issue here is gonna be power. Provide missing goods. And over here, oh right, I can get this now, hold on. The landing stages are ready to accept cargo shuttles. Now you can establish inter-orbital transportation routes. Yeah, but okay. that doesn't mean your colony is safe. The supply lines from Earth are easy targets. I'd recommend you make your colony as self-sustaining and independent as possible. You're not leaving me high and dry with that, are you? You won't, right? So I can send 20 over and it'll be 3,000 credits, or I can send any amount over that, and it'll be 10,000 credits. So I think I'm going to just send 20 for right now. Up here, your colonists are constantly exposed to cosmic radiation. Their spacesuits fend off some of it. The rest is neutralized by potent medicine like this. Time okay. To blow up some dust. Now we need to get oxygen. Establishing connection. She needs ice. Which we are now getting. And then... This is Luna. New achievement in game. Sort of grow it over here. I need power. Power on this place is from Solar Arrays, which is a mountain site. Okay. <laughs> They make it sound so easy. They just make it sound incredibly easy, except for the part that it's not. No, I didn't want another one of those. This will just move. It will be right here. How much power does this produce? A lot. We want a lot more. You know? Credit maintenance. Yeah, 2,000 credit maintenance is actually kind of scary. So let's bump that down a little bit because I don't want the moon making me go bankrupt. So 1,000 credit maintenance, I guess, is fine. Oh man, the moon is just cribble. But I need to start producing bioenhancers, which is rare earth elements. Now, rare earth elements are from a mountain site, because why wouldn't it be? And we're gonna tack you on right over here. We will put that there. Now we are low on logistics. So let's see, this will give me 36, 37, 38, 40, 42... Nine. Twenty. So it's gonna go in this area. Forty-three, right there. Totally fine with that. And my credit income just tanked. Moon, you are so expensive. Will you stop that? It's about to tank even more. Six thousand credits. Maintenance over here. So guess what we're fixing? I can't. I can't fix the credit maintenance. Only energy or logistics or workforce. So we're gonna fix the energy maintenance. Because that was pretty high too. So now... As I have... Basically no... Credit income. Again, I'm just doing this because in the future... I'm gonna need it. It's as simple as that, is in the future, I'm gonna need it. 
I can go over and fix my credit balance. That's not a problem. In fact, I'm going to do that before I start expanding anymore over there because I'm about to hit negatives and I don't want to hit negatives. Uh, load your vehicle with 30 androids from your spaceport. Do I have androids? I don't, I don't think I have androids. 30 androids? Are you talking about these? Constructor bots? Because that's all I got. What do you want? How's the assignment going? I don't have androids. Unless you gave me androids. Unless you gave me androids. Attention. Under provision of androids? consumer goods detected. I'm gonna assume those are produced in the lunar place, and I have to trade them over here to trade them to her. Which is gonna be a nightmare. You came to see me? Alright, credit balance heading on up. We're moving on up. Over two thousand just from upgrading those guys. Ah, good day. Um what can I do for you? Okay, just a little bit of lag. Oh crap. This does not supply really as like much it. as I thought it was going this to. Atmosphere of That does not supply as much as I thought it was going to. Turn two. I can't get it in there anywhere. I don't have space for this anywhere. And over here it probably wouldn't be all that great anyways. Uh, I could get it in this area if I wanted to move everything. Oh boy, that is a bit of a nightmare, um, I won't lie. Security, I can maybe plop down over here? I can move these. What is this, robot assembly hall? Yeah, I... You just move. I don't want it to be like that. I want it to just attach to the road. Just... <laughs> I haven't had to expand this production in forever either. I don't think I will ever really will. There, you're there now. Jeez. We need security in this area. Gosh. There, we got security. Now we also need information in this area. Now we also also need so, a metro uh, in this area. How do I do that? That is ridiculous. They want so much stuff, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to do all of it now. My credits balance is back up. <laughs> that's... that's a plus. So the metro doesn't reach... Uh, right okay. here. What can I, do for here. I think that might be fine, it's just because this road is a bit too long. It looks like it reaches... everywhere else but that one, and I guess that's just the furthest point from... This metro station, so I guess that'll be fine? I don't want it to be fine, but I guess it will be fine. And I can't upgrade these because I'm missing building of that type too. Which makes sense if you think about it. And I say that in a totally sarcastic manner because it does not make any sense to me. Um... Squeeze in more houses over here. If I do one there... No. I would have to do... No, that's the only way that I can fit any more over there.
But that does mean that I can upgrade you guys and then upgrade you again. Pretty, pretty nice. So my credit balance is looking pretty good. I want to keep getting more though. I will never have enough. Let's get rid of that. What if I do this? Make the road come this way. Still got it in the backlog. Now what does this look like? Something like that, that, that. <sighs> no, this will work. Uh, no, not quite like that. But basically, it would look like this. Up and down. And I'm gonna have the road come back there. I just need to get all this set up before I do that. And then I can't get any big houses over here, but I can get like a small house here. And here. And here. And I can also squeeze one in there, one in there, one in there, and one in there. I see the purpose of these little guys now. See, size doesn't matter. But well, we need info over here. So let's get some info up in here. Just attach you up. Alright, we all get over here. Then we're gonna need security in this area. I'm already seeing... I'm gonna need security in this area, so I may as well just get it now. Can I just tack a little house in here? Oh, well, no, I'm gonna need the road there for that. So this is gonna have to be here, 100%. Security... Kinda messes with things. I could do this. A row of small houses. I don't want to. Honestly. It's not something that I would think is ideal, but I can live with it. Come on. There you go. Just like that. And then we will get security. What can I say? And upgrade. Just making the neighborhood better. Getting my credits even higher. Because I like having high credits. Especially when I want to work on the moon. My water and my organic food and my fruits. My luxury food is down, my IntelliWare is down, so... I'm gonna have to start working on that pretty, pretty hard. And they need a metro over in this area, so we will tack on a metro in the area as well. Jesus. It's so big. But, I think that's where I'm gonna wrap it up. Did I wrap up the last two now with me building a metro place? I think I did. I think I did, but that's so cool. The future is gonna be neat. Anyways, my name is Nagark, this is Anno2205, and thank you for watching.